Hello everyone, in this lesson we're going to look at the steps to disable the Windows Recall AI feature on Windows 11 version 24H2 or higher releases. Although during the setup, if you have a computer with an MPU with more than 40 tops of performance, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and at least 256 gigs of storage, you will have the option to enable or disable the recall feature on your computer. Now, if it is enabled, you can disable the new Timeline AI feature on Windows 11 in more than one way. At the time of this video, the feature isn't available because devices with supported hardware are not yet available in the market. And the feature is only integrated in the latest preview of Windows 11 version 24H2. So this video is more about explaining instruction more than a hands-on video. But once you have this feature on your computer, you can use these instructions to disable it. Okay, let's dive into the steps to disable the Windows Recall AI feature on your computer. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. Now, if you want to disable the feature, it is pretty straightforward. You will need to open Start and then find the Settings app, and then you will need to go to Privacy and Security. And there, you're now going to find a new Recall and Snapshots page. Once you're inside of the page, you will have this option, Save Snapshots. If you want to completely disable Windows Recall AI on Windows 11, you need to turn this off. Once you do that, the recall feature will be disabled and stop taking snapshots of every activity on your computer. Now, let's say that you only want to prevent the feature from tracking an activity that you're about to perform. Instead of disabling the feature completely, you can disable recall just temporarily. And to do that, you will have to click the recall button on the system tray, as you can see right here. And then from the flyout menu, you will have the option called pause until tomorrow. Once you click that button, the feature will stop recording everything that you do in the computer. And then once you're ready, you can click the button again to resume or the feature will re-enable automatically the next day. Now, if you're using Windows 11 Pro Enterprise or Education, you can disable the uh, Windows Recall AI feature using the Group Policy Editor. However, remember that this option is not available on Windows 11 Home. And this is something that I can actually show you. And to do that, open Start and look for the Group Policy Editor. In this case, I'm just going to type GP Edit, and then I'm going to open the app. And then we need to open the administrator template from the user configuration section. From here, we need to open the Windows components section, and then we're going to find a Windows AI folder. In here, you're going to find the turn off saving snapshots for Windows. We need to right click on it and select the edit button. To disable Recall AI, we actually need to enable this feature to turn it off. And then just click apply and OK, and restart the computer to apply the changes. And that's it. If you don't want to use the new Timeline AI feature on Windows 11, you have at least three different ways that you can disable the feature. As I said at the beginning, remember that you will be prompted to enable or disable this feature. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.